she was born in captivity and spent almost all her life in circus. I am Marina and this is Chada's Stories for Geobits. I'm a zoologist. Me and my husband, we founded Save Wild Foundation, which operates White Rock Bear Shelter. It's a small sanctuary for rescued bears and wolves. Usually we rescue them from circus, from restaurant cages where people use them for attractions or other inappropriate conditions. Chada is 25 years old, yes, she's her grandma. She is almost blind. She spent her life in circus and later they just left her in a cage among garages and people found her and asked us to rescue. We adopted her in 2019 and since this year she lived with us. Now she is on retirement. She is amazing, she is brave, truly fighter. When we released her first time in enclosure, it's uh, always an emotional moment because it's the first time when bears see grass and see water. She searched and investigated everything around her. She was very busy, like, I need to understand what happens. What is it? Okay, it's my home now. We provided her veterinary treatment and she has her enclosure with small swimming pool with a den and a warm box. She loves very much to splash the water. It's Himalayan subspecies of brown bear, endangered subspecies. Normally they live in the Middle Asia and only several hundreds of such subspecies bears left in the world. She is really even smaller than Himalayan bear should be because she spent her life in tiny cage. She is like micro bear. It would be very risky because her weight is only 120 kilograms, but she can communicate through the fence with other bears and sometimes she even kisses the male in neighboring enclosure. Sometimes I think she is exhausted, she can be angry when other bears or wolves they can make noise, you know, she needs to stop them, like your grandma in the yard, like, <laughs> don't make noise, I am sleeping here. Chada was born in 1998, it's already a very long life. She is old, but she is rather active for old bear. She can run in enclosure, run in grass, and she walks a lot. We have mild winters and bears wake up time to time. So usually she is sleeping maybe half of winter. Of course, we are just stuff for her, but uh, we hope she likes us and she allows us to help her to have normal bear life and to learn how to be a bear after this circus life. And we really hope she will she will be with us so many years as it's possible.